So just a couple of weeks ago, I made a video about these two fake silver coins right here. These were actually sent to me by a viewer of mine who bought them at a local antique mall, and he realized they were fake pretty quickly and sent them to me to share them with you guys to keep you from getting scammed by buying things like this. And if you want to see that video, I'll put a link down below. But what I want to do in today's video is show you how these are getting into the US so you can avoid buying things like this and make sure that everything in your stack is legitimate. So let's start by taking a look at this listing on eBay. This looks like the Morgan Silver Dollar that we have right here. If you take a look, it's the exact same serial number 27886283. There are some differences with our slab in this one, though. If you look in the bottom corner, there is a crack on the eBay listing that is not present on ours. And that is unfortunate. That means there's more of these fake ones out there. Now, looking over the listing here from seller AAALP, you can see it's listed as an 1881 Carson City Morgan Silver Dollar PCGS certified MS64. And then right here under condition, it says not real. Now, that is the only place... Right here, that is the only place in this entire listing that it says anything about it not being a legitimate coin. And if we look on the left side of the screen to a novice that doesn't really know what they're looking at, this looks pretty legitimate, especially the back of it. You can see you got the NFC logo right here. You have the hologram with the PCGS symbol from NASDAQ. Everything looks pretty good, but to the seasoned stacker, the seasoned collector, there's definitely some noticeable problems here. First off, looking at this, it doesn't have the PCGS logo in the bottom corner of the slab. And additionally, this says Morgan right here. Now, the reason that's important is because this area right here is generally used for attributions, for problems like details and things like that from PCGS. So, for example, in 1921, that would be the only place on a PCGS Morgan Silver Dollar slab that they would put the word Morgan. And the reason is, in 1921, there was a Philadelphia minted Morgan Silver Dollar and a Philadelphia minted piece silver dollar. So it would say Morgan on the Morgan, piece on the piece. On the 21S Morgan silver dollar, it does not say Morgan because there was never a San Francisco minted 21 piece dollar. So that's a couple of things right off the bat that you can tell that it's fake if you miss if you happen to glance over the fact that it's not real. So if we scroll down a little bit farther on this listing, you can see this entire listing doesn't say anything about it not being real other than right here under seller notes where it says not real. And additionally, like I said, there are definitely more of these out there because this is not the one shown in that image because the one shown in that image has a crack. So where did these come from? How are these sellers getting them? And what can we do about it? We're going to talk about that, but really quick, do me a favor, guys. Don't forget to subscribe. We are almost at 100,000 subscribers, and when we get there, we will be having our biggest silver giveaway ever, so make sure you're subscribed so you can be part of that, and additionally, take a look at this giveaway from today's video sponsor. Did you know that right now, ST Bullion is giving away an entire sealed monster box of 2022 Silver Eagles? Yes, you heard that right. That is 500 ounces of one-ounce Silver Eagles. They are giving them away right now. If you would like your chance to win, make sure you head to sdbullion.com forward slash silver seeker or click the link in the description below and thank you to sd bullion for sponsoring today's video and welcome to aliexpress i mean where else on the internet did you expect us to wind up when it comes to talking about fake silver coins making it into the u.s now i'm going to show you how easy it is to get these coins into the u.s but keep in mind i'm not doing this as an instructional video i'm doing it to show you how important it is to be vigilant when buying rare silver coins and if you aren't 100 percent sure and don't know what you're doing make sure you buy them either from a reputable dealer or an authorized dealer don't buy them from some random guy on craigslist let's take a look here we are going to simply search pcgs on aliexpress's website and take a look at what pops up Right here, the first thing you can see, we have the hologram PCGS labels that we just showed you on the back of our fake silver coin. Right here, NASDAQ, CLCT, PCGS. So you can actually order those fake hologram labels. You can order already slabbed fake silver coins. Now this one's $107.52, but it's a 96S PCGS certified MS64. That's like a $5,000 coin. But what's even scarier, you can get these labels. You can get the PCGS slabs as well. If we scroll down just a little bit, I'll show you a listing that I saw earlier. And it is really, really crazy. So right here, $9.50, you can get these. But take a look at this one right here. Now, this is a listing for $125.40, but it is for a lot of 10 pieces. And what you're actually getting is a PCGS holder. It even has the PCGS logo in the bottom corner. It comes with the hologram labels as well. And you can easily print the blue label that goes inside of the holder, which is basically what we have right here. This is probably printed by someone after they received the other things that they needed to do this. You can easily print that other stuff, put it in there on your own on the printer. And before you know it, you can pretty much fake any silver coin that you want to 
with a legitimate looking slab. It's very unfortunate. Now, what's really scary about this is this actually has a review. Look at this. If you scroll all the way down, this is from a person who ordered them in the US. He says, very nice quality, sent cases, inserts, and holograms on October 24th of 2022. And that's really funny because that's really close to around the time that these exact ones right here, like what we're showing you, started showing up. So it is really unfortunate how easy it is to get these into the US. You can order the fake slabs, you get the holograms, and you can just print yourself out a label, glue them together with a fake silver coin. And by the way, you can buy these fake silver coins on Ali for like a buck or two a piece. So it is so important that you're very, very vigilant. And what happens is these wind up on websites like eBay or Etsy. In fact, take a look at this Etsy listing like I promised I would show you with Silver Eagles. Look at this listing right here. This is for a 2022 one ounce Silver Eagle. It is being sold for $20.32. So that is a huge red flag right there. This is just one example of probably a thousand I could find if I searched on Etsy long enough and other websites like OfferUp and Mercari of fake silver coins being sold and taking advantage of people that don't know any better. Now I wanna put this out to be very, very clear. There are thousands and way more than there are bad ones. There are thousands of legitimate sellers on websites like Etsy and others that sell legitimate coins. It's not knocking these websites. All I'm saying is that when you're on these websites, you need to make sure that if you see something like this and it's too good to be true, it probably is. And what's crazy about this listing is everything looks legitimate. It's listed as a 2022 one ounce silver eagle. It has the full description, which probably was a copy and paste right off of you, the US Mint's website, talking about the dual release in 2021. It says available you in plastic flips, protective tubes of 20, or mint sealed boxes of 500 coins. This is probably like a copy paste actually off of like SD Bullion or another online retailer as opposed to off the Mint's website because the Mint doesn't sell directly, you know, these directly to the public. They sell them to the authorized dealers who then turn around and sell them to you. But my point is, is that everything on this looks 100% legitimate. And what's really scary is two of these have actually sold from this listing. So when you're shopping on websites like this, like Etsy and OfferUp and the others, just make sure if it, if it looks like it's probably too good to be true, just avoid it. Look for those better listings if that's where you wanna get them from. And that is what we have for you guys today. So I hope that you enjoyed the video and learned a little bit. Do me a favor, like I said earlier, don't forget to subscribe guys, it's very important. We are almost at 100,000 subscribers and more than half the people that watch this channel are not subscribed, including in my last video where over 70% of the people that watched it are not subscribers to the channel. So help us out by doing that. Also, check out this video above. This is a video where I called around and tried to sell 10,000 silver eagles to coin shops around the US. Listen to some of their responses and we will see you in the next video.